1990, there was no better player in college basketball. Detroit Northern alum Derek Coleman was chosen first overall in that year's NBA draft. Yeah, and with his playing career long over, he's still having a huge impact both on and off the court in the city he loves. Here's Steve Gargiola. If you never saw Derek Coleman play basketball, you missed a real treat. Derek grew up in Detroit, was a basketball star at Syracuse, drafted into the NBA, where he played 15 seasons before retiring in 2005. Derek Coleman loves basketball and the city of Detroit. And in a partnership with Focus Hope this summer, he is determined to share the love. Heck no. All right, we work. About 150 kids are part of Derek's camp at the Adams Butzel Complex. Put it in the square. There you go. They're learning basketball skills, but really that's only where it starts. Getting kids the opportunity not only just to play the game of basketball in a safe environment, but to also develop friendships and relationships that will last them a lifetime. <laughs> there you go. You might think of Focus Hope for its work in job training for adults, but children are a big focus of their mission. We're really trying to uh, educate the kids on sportsmanship, uh, really on creativity. Which is why, more than sports, their programs include reading, arts, math, technology. Take your time, take your time. There you go, make a jump shot, make a jump shot. And the partnership between Focus Hope and Derek Coleman was a natural. You are <laughs> DC is from that community. He represents the city of Detroit well. He's for the kids in the city of Detroit. And he's for Focus Hope as well. Actually, Focus Hope is in my neighborhood, in my community, where I grew up at. You know, and again, to bring exposure to what they're trying to do in that neighborhood, in that community, is always about how do we keep continuing to teach our children. Way to take your time, good shot. And there is plenty of teaching going on out here. I'm learning sportsmanship, how to build teamwork, and how to use strategies to move to different places. Because I never played basketball before. To learn how to be a better player and being a better teammate. Hands, hands, hands. One thing Derek doesn't have to worry about is his ego getting in the way. Most of these kids don't even know this big guy played in the NBA. But they mom, uncle, aunts, whoever bring them into that gym, they like, hey, do y'all know who that is? Not today, Shaq. Ah, thank goodness for YouTube. He even had kids come in this morning like, hey, Coach Coleman, you dunked on Shaq. I'm like, yeah, I dunked on a lot of people. <laughs> Derek has taught more than a few lessons on the basketball floor. Come on, let's line up. He says Focus Hope gives these kids three things, patience, structure, and... Third thing will always be, you know, your vision and where are we going from here, you know, and what are we instilling in those kids, you know, because they're dreamers also, you know, and we got to teach them to keep continuing to dream. Because where are we without dreams? Oh, we won! I'm Steve Garagiola, Local 4. You know, you know, it's great is some of those kids who have never played basketball, he might be able to find or inspire them. They start practicing. One of those becomes the next Derek That's Coleman true. coming out of Detroit. I also like the fact that they're like, yeah, you're cool. And then they look it up like, wait, no, you're really cool. Yeah, I saw something. I didn't on know. It's amazing. Great story. <laughs> now here's a look at what.